how did I make those scale textures? So, um, there are, are many ways you can do this. So, um, uh, I used this tool right here. This this part of the tool, yeah. So I'm I'm gonna show you two ways. Two ways I can you can do this. So once once you have the, your uh, snake right, and you wanna texture it. Let's say this is a snake. Uh, I'm using monster clay uh, for demonstration purposes. I choose this clay because it was uh, faster to um, uh, work with. So let's say, okay, let me let me try to make the the head real quick. So let's say this is the head of the snake, right? So let's say this is the head, and so I'm gonna stretch the body out a little bit more. Right, and I'm gonna give it a, a snake kind of look. All right, and then curve it out okay so this is my snake right and I'm gonna give you guys a little demonstration here so this is that's that's where one eye goes and then this is where the other eye is, right? So this is just for demonstration, uh, right? And then they have like a standout right here. All right, something kind of like that. I apologize for my dog. He's very happy that, that he's here with me. And he's just playing around and stuff like that. So he's the one making noises. All right, so here's the snake, right? And let's say you wanna <clears throat> uh, apply uh, scale textures. So the way I did this, I use this tool like this, right? And started making like little kind of arrows facing one direction, like that. Oh, shoot. So you gotta like this right I I think I did it the other way around Oh yeah 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 my bad my bad my bad Sorry it's been a while and I, that that technique I didn't use it afterwards. All 
Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So um, it was it, it was the other way. So um, it's supposed to be like this. So uh, yeah, you can go like this. So I'm gonna do one side of the snake so y'all be able to see. And then, yep. Exactly, so just grab this tool and start making little patterns on the clay. See? And just just go like this. Yeah, yeah, my bad. I I uh it's been a while since I do a snake like this with this kind of scale. But yeah, look at that. That that's beautiful. I love it. I love it. I like I like it how it looks. So yeah. Um This is monster clay, so it'll uh uh, get the details in there really really good like um, Monster clay is designed for that. It's not an oven baked clay. It's just a clay for mold making and stuff like that So yeah Look at that that looks like dragon scale or something like uh, Yeah, I like it. I like it so you can do it all the way all the way till the, the end of the tail uh, and it'll look amazing. It'll look, it'll look very, very good on your snakes. So yeah, that's one way to make the scales. And the other one is not, not. I don't use it too much, but I did use it on one of my snakes. And it's like you use this tool, the bigger, the biggest, uh, 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 the one with the biggest uh, little ball or something, and you just go like this yeah. it won't it won't look that cool but uh, it'll add a very nice effect after you paint it but um, this is another way you can do it if you don't have the tool Just like that. Yeah. I one of one of the snakes that I did is just like this. Just like that. Yeah. So there are two ways right there. And yeah. All right. I hope you enjoy the video and uh, let me know if you have any other doubts or any other questions on how to make something else. Uh, appreciate it.